Tuesday. We're going on a boat tour to Tubingen. I want to wear these jeans, but then what shirt with the jeans? That's the question. I just don't know. Oh, you know what? I do kind of really like this, but then I'm going to have to change bras. Wear this, right? They get craft leg right here. No, I love Paris, perhaps. I actually really like this shirt. Oh, maybe I do. I love Paris. Is it too touristy though? That's the question. Let's try it on and see. Why not? No, I can't. I can't. It's so cute, but like, I, I just feel weird. I think I'm just gonna wear this brandy shirt. We're gonna call it a day. Ooh, I really like it like this. <gasps> this is it. This is the fit. It feels like the weeks have flown by. The fact that I'm going to be gone in like 10 days, absolutely insane. I feel like sometimes it's felt really slow, but then as I reflect on how much time I've been here, I'm like, it went by so fast. This necklace would be really cute, but I feel like this necklace would be really classy. And we're gonna go with the classy one. I think the bra is kind of a vibe. At least that's what I'm telling myself. You know, exactly. I got these jeans at a thrift store like two years ago, and they're literally my lifesavers here. They've been my lifesavers all summer. I love them. Okay. Time for a montage. Tubing in was magical. It was just so picturesque. I think everywhere you turned, there's this new thing to see, a new shop to walk in, a new cafe to eat in, and it was magical. We went on a gondola ride, and I honestly think it was one of the most serene and peaceful things I've ever experienced. It was so beautiful. Putting my hand in the water felt so relaxing. The ducks and the swans that floated upon the river, even the people that were sitting on the ledges looking out on the river, it was all so majestic. I always say this when I describe this trip, but I don't have the words to do this town justice. And it's in moments like these that I thought to myself, it is such a beautiful feeling to be alive and to be experiencing this and to be living my life to the fullest. And I just wanted to soak in every single moment of this gondola ride and of this town. It's so hot. I think the weather here is so beautiful, but because of the no AC, because we walk and ride bikes everywhere, I don't think I've ever been more hot in my life. But that's okay. Today we toured Schloss Ludwigsburg, which is an old castle. I gotta turn on a fan. Today was beautiful. Elegantly historic, I think is the word that I would use. Because obviously in America we have history, but a lot of it is on the East Coast. It's very new. But in Europe, it's so cool to think that generations and generations of people have been in the castle that I stepped in. Our tour guide said that Napoleon was in one room. The Napoleon. Napoleon, the French guy. And the fact that I stepped in the same room as him, it gave me such an out-of-body, historical sense of my place in the world. That we really are very small. Because if you think about it, all of these people that existed in this castle, whether they were a servant, whether they were a duke, they're all wiped away. And I think that thought is so comforting and also nihilistic at the same time. And it put me in such a beautiful mood about life. Overall, that part of Germany has been one of my favorite things. I do think that being here has also made me see value in where I come from, in the US and the things that we hold dear to our hearts. And I think I can appreciate both at the same time. officially only have a week left. We toured Heidelberg yesterday. We went up to a castle that was destroyed in the war. Yet even still, it was so beautiful. There's a museum of pharmacy. They have these bottles that were literally hundreds and hundreds of years old. It was really cool to think of chemists from hundreds of years ago standing there studying things and the knowledge that they possessed versus the knowledge that I, as a very average human, I'd say, knows about the human body. Things like that make this trip so much more surreal. There's a party tonight. Someone is turning 18. I love hanging out with all of these people. People that I don't know if I'm ever going to see again in my life. But I think while that is very sad, it also makes it all the more wonderful and something that I should really cherish. So yeah, that concludes week two. Sooner or later, I will be done. Truly wild. Truly wild. Oh my goodness. Hey.